Hello! Today we will be making a line following robot. A line following robot is a type of autonomous robot that is designed to follow a specific path. In our case, a black line on a white background. And why should we build in code a line following robot? Because it helps us understand two fundamental parts of any robot feedback from a sensor and controlling the robot. We are going to use the Lego Spike Prime kit, that is the hub, motors and most importantly the colour sensors to assemble a line following robot. The colour sensors are crucial, they sense the colour of the path, in our case black, and provide feedback to the hub. The hub uses that feedback to determine which direction it should turn to keep the colour sensor on path. Please check our tutorial on the colour sensor, link in the description. First, we need to tell the robot what is black and what is white. To do this, we need to use the colour sensor. After a bit of trial and error, we found that if you use this code and the robot is on white or black, it will say what colour it is. Please note that our robot has two colour sensors and right sensor is what we named the colour sensor on the right. If you have named your colour sensors something different, please change the code accordingly. Here you can see that each time I move the black square below the colour sensor, it detects that change in colour from white to black. Now we know what numbers we need to put in, we need to tell the robot how to move. To do this, we need to code the robot, but this time we tell it to turn away from the line if it sees black. Then when the a sensor can't see black, it turns in the opposite direction till it sees black. This causes side-to-side -side movement while moving forward. Please note that this just uses one colour sensor. Now, make a line on a white background and let's test out our code. As you can see, it moves only on the black line. Congratulations, you have made the line following robot. The things to test are, how fast can we make it? How many colour sensors can we use instead of one? And can we make it do a loop while following a line? Remember to keep coding.